you might have seen a viral clip claiming that all eels come from the Sargasso Sea. It's an intriguing notion, but does it hold water? Before we answer that question, let's explore the extraordinary journey eels undertake from lava to adulthood. These slippery characters are full of surprises. Eels are catadromous fish, nature's rebels. While salmon, which are anadromous, swim upstream to spawn, eels do the opposite, migrating from fresh water to the salty embrace of the ocean to reproduce. Their life story unfolds in five fascinating acts. Our tale begins with a peculiar lava called lectocephalus, meaning slim head, a transparent, leaf-shaped wisp drifting through ocean currents. These tiny travelers feast on marine snow, a fancy term for the ocean's organic debris that includes dead organisms and fecal matter. As our lectocephalus grows, it transforms into a glass eel, still transparent, but now unmistakably eel-shaped. It's nature's way of saying, I'm not a leaf anymore. Now comes the heroic journey. Our glass eel, driven by ancient instincts, heads for fresh water. As it travels, it gains pigmentation and becomes an elver. Most of these young eels push upstream, showcasing Olympic level climbing skills as they conquer weirs, dams and waterfalls. Some angulid elvers, however, prefer to remain in brackish and marine areas near the coast. Elvers dine on a gourmet spread of crustaceans, worms and insects. The elver grows into a yellow eel. This is the stage most of us picture when we think eel. In the final transformation, our eel turns silver signaling its readiness to return to the ocean and complete the cycle. Some marine eel species, like moray eels, don't undergo the silver transformation. They spend most of their lives in the ocean and don't have the same migratory needs. Thus, don't need to undergo the same physical changes. Now, to our burning question. Do all eels truly hail from the Sargasso Sea? The short answer is no. While the Sargasso Sea is indeed the romantic rendezvous point for American and European eels, it's not the universal eel nursery. Other species have their own preferred spawning grounds. Japanese eels, for instance, prefer the waters near the Suruga Seamount by the Mariana Islands. Southern African eels are drawn to the Indian Ocean north of Madagascar. New Zealand longfin eels journey to the Pacific Ocean near Tonga. This story of eels is one of nature's most captivating narratives, full of mystery, transformation and resilience. From the mysterious depths of various oceans to the meandering rivers of continents worldwide, Eels embark on epic migrations that rival the greatest adventures in nature. <laughs>